Hello Truth Seekers and welcome back to our channel where we unveil the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Ladies and gentlemen, gather around as we dive headfirst into the latest royal scandal that has tongues wagging in the palace in disarray. King Charles, it seems, has finally put his foot down, and rightfully so, against the incessant emotional blackmail orchestrated by none other than the notorious Duke and Duchess of Sussex, Prince Harry, and Meghan Markle. In a shocking turn of events, the King has reportedly banned the Sussexes from all royal events, a move that many are applauding as a long overdue stand against their hideous plot to manipulate the monarchy. But before we move on to any further details, I I would love to thank you all for your enormous love and support, and in case you haven't subscribed to my channel, what are you guys waiting for? Hit that subscribe button now, and don't forget to press the bell icon. Perfect, so let's get started. So now let's dissect this royal bombshell and expose the ludicrous demands and manipulative tactics employed by Meghan and her puppet Harry. The recent revelation suggests that King Charles, in a moment of clarity and strength, has refused to be emotionally blackmailed by his own son. Yes, you heard that right, Prince Harry's attempts at emotional manipulation have hit a brick wall and it's about time. The trigger for this royal showdown omits Scobie's controversial book Endgame, which accidentally spilled the names of alleged royal racists. It appears that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have been using the scandalous expose to their advantage, putting immense pressure on King Charles to bend to their whims. Richard Eden, a royal expert, shed light on the situation, stating that King Charles' refusal to give in to emotional blackmail is a commendable decision. He pointed out how Harry and Meghan have been making King Charles feel like a failure, pushing him to the brink with their relentless demands. Eden stated, I am pleased King Charles is not giving up on this because I don't think anyone should give in to that sort of emotional blackmail if you want to call it that. Bravo, King Charles, for standing firm against their machinations. The infamous phase emotional blackmail has become synonymous with the Sussexes, and it's no surprise that it left the king exacerbated. Charles Griffiths, the male's editor at large, concurred, expressing that King Charles seems to be sick and tired of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's games. She emphasized the importance of his decision, stating he is done being blackmailed by the emotions of naming the royal racists. In Scobie's Endgame, Harry allegedly pleaded with his father, asking, don't you want to see your grandchildren? After the Sussexes were evicted from Frogmore Cottage, the sheer audacity of such a statement speaks volumes about their manipulative tactics. It's clear that the Sussexes are not just leeching onto royal names, they're attempting to strong-arm the monarchy into submission. The ban on the Sussexes from royal events is a wise move, signaling that King Charles has had enough of their emotional manipulation. It's a declaration that the monarchy won't be held hostage by their demands any longer. The people are rallying behind King Charles, hoping that this marks the beginning of the end for Meghan and Harry's disgusting plot against the royal family. In conclusion, the ban on the Sussexes is a resounding victory for those who have grown tired of their antics. King Charles, by refusing to bow down to emotional blackmail, has shown the royal family he will not be bullied. As the dust settles, we eagerly await the next chapter of this royal saga, hopeful that it brings the end to Meghan and Harry's hideous plot. So what do you think about this news guys? Please share your thoughts in the comments below and let me know what you think. Until then, stay tuned for more shocking stories and scandalous exposés on our YouTube channel. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated on the latest from the world of the royal family. Thanks for watching, we'll see you again with some more fascinating news about the royal family. Bye for now.